that was lost was bringing the truck, the semi truck to my pickup truck, putting the grass on the side over there, and basically everything else that they did prior to the truck, like after the truck flipped at the railroad crossing. That's the only part that we missed. Everything else is back to normal. Um, I gotta bring that one tractor back. I'm gonna do that at the end of the video. Hopefully, it doesn't crash. But yeah. Right head back over there. Start chopping again. See how far we can get. Um, just so you guys know, I'm thinking about selling that disc right there that's behind the shed and buying. that it only takes 200 horsepower and I can also adjust the working speed but I'm thinking about it because one it's bigger than the plow than the disc that we own where's that at I'll find it by three meters it's not much bigger but it's bigger I put some of the silage that's maximum capacity so you know I put the silage from that silo right there in here in the hay in here from that silo. Um, because when we get cows, I don't know where I'm gonna put the cow pasture yet. Unless I've already placed it. No, I have not. I don't know where I should place it. Maybe if you guys get a good idea where we should place it. I'm thinking of placing it right next to the farm, but I don't know where it would. I thought about getting rid of some of this field for it. See how this goes. There we go, chopping away. But um, I know I said I wouldn't do anything on Christmas, but I thought to myself, why do the stream on the 23rd, 24th, and I can just do it on Christmas Day? But as soon as we are done uh, with this chopping part of the field, I will go and harvest that. I think this was wheat. I can't remember if it was wheat or not. The real thick spot. back for it. Gonna have to. And I didn't know how big that thing was. You know what, he's already on that side. We'll just hit this last swath right here. That's the last swath. We'll just leave those though. And I'm thinking about doing a seasons version of this. Um Tell me in the comment section if you guys want me to do a seasoned version of the Let's Play. Like, should I make, whenever I finish this episode, whenever I finish this uh, map, on, on this map, this Let's Play series on this map, should I make the next map a seasoned geo, or should I just leave it like this and start a whole other Let's Play and make it seasoned? Currently only 10:20 in the morning. I'm already making this video. This video probably isn't coming out. Oh shoot! This 
video probably won't come out. You guys probably won't see this video from tomorrow or somewhere later than that. Dang. And it is a 26, just so you know. At least the back off of that. Wow, that could have been closer. That's wow. I think this thing's max capacity is 21.59. Oh, I'm an idiot. Drove off on the wrong side. Well, let me see how this goes. Quick, 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 quick. Yeah. Dope. Tried to fix my mouse where it was on the mouse pad. That's what happens. So I do need to go spread. I don't know, do I have weeds turned on? No, weeds are off, okay. That's sort of good. Cable management needs to be done. I mean, I've already done it once, but... I can do it even better. I think I did this field with this sprayer in like three passes. I need like two and a quarter, two and a half. What fields do I own? I own two as well. I own one, two, 13, 15, 14, 18. 29 is a lease. Speaking of which, I can give that. Oh, wrong button. I can get that back to him. Alrighty. Yeah, this thing has a crazy width. that down. Fire her up. There we go. Raise her up a little bit. Would it even be worth doing that last bit? I don't know. I'll probably lose more than I'll get more crops out of that. I'm trying to fold it up. Because I feel like I'll lose more than anything. I don't know why I'm folding it up. What the heck is a sprayer doing, guys? It's dancing. It is dancing. But, um... Oh, that's on me. What I'm going to do here, guys, is I want to show you this DEF mod and what comes in it. So if any of you guys out there that have Farming Simulator uh, ever want to play with me, we're going to be using a DEF mod. And you can see it over here, right above the uh, gas, how much fuel you have left. This is DEF 99% blue. Um... What DEF is, it's sort of like, in real life tractor or something called DEF. I forget what it's used for, but I think it's for the engine, because I'm not that good with DEF. But, um, they do have DEF pumps and DEF storage. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put DEF pumps somewhere on the map. I'm going to put DEF storage somewhere else, or on this farm somewhere. They're both only $5,000 to purchase, which is bad. 
So you gotta hit your shop button, which for me would be P. If you're on Xbox, it's W. It's uh the two squares. I have to go into buildings. Uh, my store is gonna look a lot different than yours because I have a, a mod installed, but it'll be under miscellaneous. It'll be the first one that's a mod. Probably. So where should I put the diff bomb? I wanna put it by I wanna put it with all the gas stations. Is there no gas station on this map? Oh yeah there is. It's down here. It's actually pretty close to my field. My farm actually. I'm gonna put it right here. And put one right here. And then I also have this dev storage mod. It has like 10,000 liters of storage, I think, is what it said. Um, we're going to put it right about... Well, where should I put it? No clue. We have fuel storage there. If it lets me put it here, I'll put it here. Right there. We're good. Telehandler. Oh, I must not have done that. I thought I did. So, guys, uh, what we're gonna do here. This video is probably gonna be like 15 minutes long because if I end it here, because I trim, I'm gonna trim out quite a bit of it. Um, what we're gonna do is I'm gonna buy a def trailer, like the whole def and diesel. Probably gonna cost a lot of. It's probably gonna spin. I filled that thing up with gasoline, and I think it costed me five hundred thousand dollars. No, it cost me forty thousand dollars for fuel. It was crazy expensive. Sixty-eight thousand. Wait, was that the one? I don't remember if that's the one or not, but let's run my semi. But it's a pickup truck, though. coming this way because I can't see out my window. So Traffic 
see this truck stops at 74, not bad. I swear if I flip this truck. I'm recording at 21 minutes as of now, but you guys will probably see 18, 17, 19-ish minutes. I'm going to be cutting out quite a bit of this video. Mainly you guys will see most of the spraying that I've done. Just so that way it doesn't bore you. The semi truck doesn't actually have depth, that's weird. Diesel exhaust fluid is what it's called. That's gonna take quite a bit of money from me. How much does it actually give you for money? Ten thousand liters. I don't know how much it gives you. How much money it costs you? I wish it told you. Eighty-seven thirty-seven. Eighty-seven thirty-two. Oh, eighty-seven twenty-seven. That's my sprayer tractor. That's my tractor, of course. Can I only go near the tops, please? Wonder when they'll be harvesting that one. I should probably do some contract work considering the fact that that death is going to take a lot of money out of us. Have you seen a track to take air? Oh, here you go. That's because I was screwing around with the uh, landscaping tool when I made that, when I bought that silo right there. It went all haywire with the ground. So. Tried to fix it, oh, made it worse. That's why I don't try to fix things in life. They only make them worse. Um, only thing I think I have left to do now is grab this dual wheel tractor. Start planting soybeans and corn. What do I have and what? So 15 and 14. 15 is ready to harvest, 14 and 13, I, most of 13 I've done, four things. So I'm thinking corn, soybeans, soybeans. I'm thinking 13 and 14 and 1 are soybeans, 2 and 15 are corn. And we're silaging the corn, just so you guys know. That's going to be a pain in my butt. That's also why I got this in my truck trailer, like more chaff. It's gonna be a while. And, uh, don't text and drive. Oh, I just realized this uh, rod that lets you get, get stuck. That could cost uh, could cost me some money. That truck would get stuck in there. But you know what? <clears throat> I've had this mod before, and that truck that I bought. The reason I bought it is because I still haven't got it stuck to this day. It still has not been stuck. I don't know what I'm doing. I gotta cultivate first. I'll plow and stuff like that. I also gotta get the uh, harvested over there. And you know, this is not the tractor that I should use for that. Let me see, does it need plowing? It just needs lime, it says. 15 and 14 and 1 only. Oh, okay, 1 needs lime. Screw 1. 15 or 14 need a line. That's it. They don't need to be plowed, so I just have to cultivate them. But, we gotta get into some of our combine here. It's gonna be a long day. And oh yeah, we're only gonna have to pick up truck in the auger wagon because the semi trucks over there are uh, taking fuel. The diesel exhaust fluid. I'm 
I'm gonna do bales out of this field, guys. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm actually gonna have to get enable straw swath. No, it disabled it. I think it's disabled. And I should be able to just hire out a worker considering the fact that it should all be done. Enough to where he could start making his turnarounds. I think I just took out like a one crop. sure before I send out this worker that straw swamp is enabled. I know it said it was enabled, but just want to make sure. Okay, it's out of Find my auger wagon tra tractor. I don't remember where I put the auger out. Right there. Still going down. The wheat we can actually keep. Head on over there. So I'm actually going to keep the wheat just so that way I can um, get more stuff ready for the cows. So that's that. Oh wow, it spun the tires when it started up. I don't know if there's anything else I should add to it. Alright. But the mirrors are actually pretty good on this truck. Except for the passenger side mirror. It's always the passenger side mirror that doesn't work. The rear rear mirror would work if I didn't have my trailer on. Oh crap, crap, crap. Forgot, 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 forgot. Come on, baby, get out of the cold mud. Okay, okay, you're good. He said it. As long as you don't stop, you don't get stuck. Dude, I'm only at 34%. And you guys know how long we've been doing this. Let's Just in case. Because I know this track is not going to break the game again. I don't think it was the tractor that broke the game. I think it was just because I was streaming and I had this on. It was, like, it was just so much for this PC that hit. We're not for the PC, but for the game that hit. See, this game has done that to me before. I went to save the game, I saved it. I went to leave the game, this was off camera, and my guy would get kicked out of his tractor, but it wouldn't leave the game. It was weird, I was like, oh, okay. What I should have did was, when I hit ESC, when it was stuck, went over and saved the game, quit. That way, it was saved. But I did. Only the tractor's passenger side of yours worked. I don't think you need your four ways as long as you have a But I know at nighttime you need your lights out as far as your tires are. That's why I think they should make all mods that have like triple wheels. Like I'll show you what I mean for a second. Because I'm not gonna be able to buy this tractor ever. Oh, it'd be under extra large and track tractors. The Steiger, you can put triple wheels on this thing. But the light only comes out to about the second tire. I don't know if you guys can see. Yeah, you guys can see my cursor. You see what I'm talking about? Like, from here. This light actually needs, re and realistically, needs to be out here for legal purposes. 
the light has to be on the outside part of the tractor. Look at my money fly. I don't even know where I should set my tractors at this point. I just park them up. At this point. Oh, I can't do the other field now because I have that other tractor over there for it. I could try it. Well, how much horsepower does that thing take? Two hundred and eighty. Biggest tractors are the eighty-seven thirty-sevens. I could do the eighty-seven thirty-two. I think even the seventy-seven twenty-six will work with it. About one eighty-seven thirty-two. 8727 should work. 8727 is right there. 300. I completely forget what I said. 280. Yeah, we're good. So, yeah, even our smallest track. Do that. I'm just half scared to death of that 8732 because it crashed my game last night. I, I don't think it was that the crash game, like I said. York. I don't know how much of that field that worker even has done yet. Oh, he's got to be close. Oh, he has a full grain tank as soon as I say something. Of course you do. There's always wait till I say something. Oh, wow, never mind. No, we're close. He's only got four lanes. How do you miss that, dude? Workers. Incompetent. Always. I should have started from that side. That's probably on me. I don't know how to cut straight. And it is now. We gotta wait. 13 track every single track was in use except for that one that crashed the game last night. Well guys, I think I'm gonna end the video here. So hope y'all have a happy new year. Hashtag
2020 needs to end. See you guys next time. Like and subscribe if you're new. Peace.